Take a look at the pitch mix for the professor. Fastball at 87.5 miles per hour. Changeup has been a real great weapon for him again this year. Curveball not in play very much, less than 4% of the time. Brewers, winners of 13 of their last 17, saw an end to their nine game winning streak last night. Christian Yelich digs in. Sun splashed Wednesday afternoon at Wrigley. First pitch and a base hit to right. Good start for the crew. Yeah, Hendricks' numbers kind of deceiving. A 5 and 7 record, 380 is earned run average. Swing and a miss, strike three. Breaking ball or a changeup, something off speed, certainly. Santana works the walk. And it's first and second for the Brewers with one away. Of the plate, be a tough man to double unless it's a sharply hit ground ball. On the ground, softly hit, magical. They get an out at second, that's all they'll get. So the Brewers have runners on the corners with two outs for Willie Adamas. Here's the pitch. High pop fly, playable on the infield. Dansby Swanson says, I'm going to make that play and does. Gansby ran in, caught the ball near the mound. Hendricks gets out of it. No runs from Milwaukee. Miguel Amaya doing the catching, the only difference. Brandon Woodruff climbs the mound, getting ready to go. Two men on. That's a big break on an 0-2 pitch. Boy. And the batter now is Ian Happ. Happ hits one in the air to right field. On the run, Canna. That ball is up against the wall. One run is in. Horner goes to third. He's going to be held on a double by Happ. Cubs lead one to nothing. 0-2 pitch, swing and a miss. He struck him out. Blew a fastball by Bellinger at the very top of the strike zone. Bellinger fans, Dansby Swanson now has a very important at bat in this game. Swing and a liner, left field. And Yelich makes the catch, tagging from third and sprinting across. And then sliding in is Nico Horner. It's a sack fly. And the Cubs have jumped out 2 nothing. Fort Telez. Four for his last nine with a home run. And this is lined in the left center field. That is going to get down for Rowdy Telez. And Tachman did a good job of getting over there and collecting it on a hop. Canna's average up to 254. Eight home runs, 43 driven in. Bounce back to the mound, knocked down by Hendricks. He will throw to first in time. A 2 2. Strike three call. Terang is out on strikes. He was not expecting a fastball. Check swing and a little flare. Horner makes the catch. Nico ranging far to his left. It's Christian Yelich to begin things against Kyle Hendricks. Swung on and tapped out in front of the plate. This will be a play for Hendricks who picks it up barehanded and throws it away. Goes out of play into the netting and that'll give second base to Christian Yelich. We've seen two bobbles from him now. Potential double play ball in the second inning and now throws one away. Man in scoring position for Contreras. And that's a fair ball down the right field line. The Brewers are going to get a run out of it as Contreras delivers for Milwaukee. It's two to one. Contreras dancing off of first. The pitch ground ball right side. Horner will go to second. They get one and the throw to first is not in time. And that is through there. Got him looking. Third strikeout for Kyle. The next offering low and outside. Three and two. There goes Santana. Here's a smash up the middle. Diving stop by Nico Horner. Throws to first. He got him. What a great play. Dazzling play by Nico Horner. Very similarly to Horner getting hit on an elbow guard in the first. That's exactly where that pitch clipped left handed batting Ian Happ. Two men on, one away. Cody Bellinger, the batter. The right hander is 3 2. He has swung on and popped up. Right side of the infield, it is Rowdy Telez making the call, moving into foul territory. He makes the catch. Two gone, it's up to Dansby Swanson. Here it is, 1 2. Swing and a miss. He did get out of it, elevating a 97 mile an hour heater, and the inning is over. Gone looking. Low fastball call for strike three. Punch out number five. Three one pitch popped in a right. Can of corn for Mark Canna. Wind has a hold of it. It's blowing it over towards the seats, but still plenty of room for Mark to make the catch. And the inning is over. Andrew Monasterio at the plate, the number nine hitter. Line drive caught by a leaping madrigal at third, one away. Now Kyle comes inside and this ball gets smoked. The one two. Swing and a miss, strike three. Got him with the changeup, two away. Kyle not paying any attention at all to Contreras at first. As Santana looking out at Hendricks. And two balls and two strikes. Ground ball towards the middle. 
Horner knocks it down. He just saved a run. Base hit for Santana, but Horner's effort just saved a run. And so the Brewers hoping that Sal Freelich can come through here. His third look at Hendricks. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Got him with the changeup. And Hendricks works out of the jam. The Brewers leave two. It'll be Miguel Amaya to lead things off against Woodruff here in the bottom of the fifth. Struck him out. Another K for Brandon Woodruff. That's the sixth. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Chased a fastball down for Woodruff, his seventh of the afternoon. Here's the 2 1 pitch. Fly ball on the left side of the infield. Drifting into foul territory now is Andrew Monasterio. And the wind blowing that back even inside the third base bag. It was down the line a little bit. A pop up for Monasterio and a 1 2 3 inning for Brandon Woodruff here in the bottom of the fifth. And there's one away for Rowdy Telez. Swing and a miss on a changeup. Hendricks strikes out Telez. Out number two, sixth inning. Here's a bouncer to third. Should be routine for Madrigal. The toss across. Got him. Inning over. Three up, three down. Two first inning runs for the Cubs. They scored one time yesterday. It held up for a 1 0 victory. Swanson to third. Monasterio across the diamond. And another 1 2 3 inning for Brandon Woodruff. He is rolling through six. And now a new man on the mound, Julian Merriweather. Out number one. Check swing. Did he go? Yes, he did. Strike three. Amaya pointing down to Angel Hernandez on that check swing by the right handed batter. The 2 2. Here it comes. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Merriweather works 1 2 3. Very impressive inning for him. Telez works a walk. And the bases are loaded. Back to back walks with two outs. Alzali coming in. Brewers have him loaded here in the top of the eighth with two outs, trailing two to one. Canna has never faced Alzali. And he hit him. This game is tied on a hit by pitch by none other than Mark Canna. My goodness. What a way to tie it. How about that? The left handed batting Tarang swinging a fly ball. Center field. Talkman is there coming in. Makes the catch. But the Brewers get even. But runners advance to second and third with only one away. Hey, now for Ian, you've got to put this ball in play. The 2 0 pitch. And it's a ground ball to Telez. Comes home with it. Contreras supplies the tag. And the Brewers get a huge second out here in the eighth. That is out number two. Now Bellinger, a chance to be a hero. That one redirects off the pitcher's leg. Monasterio save. And the run scores. Bellinger hit a smash off the foot of Piomps. The ball rolled over toward the third baseline. Monasterio picked it up. His throw to first too late. Yeah, this will be an error on Bellinger on the throw, I got to believe. Christian Yelich, the batter, the pitch. Ground ball to Nico. Goes to second one. Swanson to first. Call it to a double play. They turn it 4 6 3. And the Cubs are an out away from taking two of three for the first place Brewer. Tyrone Taylor is the pinch runner. Santana has walked, hit into a fielder's choice. That one ground in. Swanson, ball game. How about that? Cubs win. Dansby ran over to cover second. The runner was going. The ball hit right to Swanson, and the Cubs had the win.